In this question, we're being asked to write a new equation after a function is translated vertically. That is, it's moved up or down. The function we're starting with here is 4x squared minus 5. And then um, we're being asked to translate that vertically downward by 5 units. So if this was on a graph, uh, this is a, a quadratic equation. So this is some kind of parabola, right? So it might look like this to start with. And then we'll just move it down. So how do we how do we do that? What how does um, how does that reflect it in the equation? Well, I, I want to go over to a graphing calculator. Um, this one is Desmos.com. It's my favorite. Um, here we've got the equation for this function already typed in: four x squared minus five. And you can see it is indeed a parabola. What this four does on multiplied by x squared is, is it squishes it. So it's kind of a, a long narrow parabola. What the minus 5 does is just move it down 5. Uh, uh, the basic function, uh, just x squared, would have its vertex at the origin here at 0, 0. And what you can see, this one has its vertex at 0, negative 5. So that negative 5, that minus 5, moved it down 5 units. So if we want to move it down 5 units more, we just subtract another 5 from it. So instead of minus 5, this would be minus 10. You can see, uh, indeed, that moves it down so that the vertex is at minus 10. If you wanted to move a, a function up, you would add to it. And if you want to move it down, you subtract from it. So it's as simple as that. So if we want to translate this down five units, our new function, h of x, is just going to be 4x squared and minus 5 minus another 5, or minus 10. So that's how to write the equation uh, for a vertical translation of a function.